A new geological threat is emerging from the depths of the Atlantic Ocean. For centuries, we have considered this vast expanse of water a place of relative geological calm, an ocean basin that is steadily and quietly growing wider. But that perception has been shattered. Scientists have found compelling evidence of a new tectonic boundary forming deep below the waves off the coast of Portugal. A massive section of the Earth's rigid outer layer is beginning to weaken and sink into the planet's molten interior. This is the birth of a new subduction zone, a geological engine capable of unleashing the most powerful earthquakes and tsunamis known to humankind. This discovery fundamentally rewrites our understanding of the Atlantic. Subduction zones are the planet's great collision points where one tectonic plate is forced to dive beneath another. They are responsible for the violent volcanic eruptions and mega-earthquakes that define the Pacific Ocean's infamous Ring of Fire. The Atlantic, by contrast, was thought to be a passive ocean, largely free from such destructive power. Now, researchers have found that a process once thought to be unique to the Pacific is beginning right on Europe's doorstep creating a new and unpredictable seismic hazard for coastal populations on four continents. The warning signs of this hidden activity have been etched into the pages of history. On the 1st of November, 1755, the city of Lisbon was annihilated by one of the most powerful earthquakes ever recorded in Europe. The initial shockwaves leveled much of the city, but the horror was just beginning. Massive fires broke out, and less than an hour later, a catastrophic tsunami swept inland from the Atlantic. Three colossal waves, some estimated to be dozens of feet high, engulfed the harbor and the downtown area, completing the city's destruction. The event was so powerful that its effects were felt across the globe, from the coasts of Africa to the distant islands of the Caribbean. For centuries, the origin of this ghost earthquake was a profound mystery, as there was no known fault line capable of producing such devastation. This new research provides a chillingly plausible explanation. The Great Lisbon Earthquake was not a random anomaly, but a violent birth pang from this newly forming subduction zone. The mechanism driving this immense geological shift is a testament to the slow, relentless power of nature. It all begins with water. Over millions of years, seawater has been infiltrating deep cracks and fissures in the ocean floor, percolating miles down into the hot, dense rock of the Earth's upper mantle. There, it triggers a crucial chemical reaction known as serpentinization. As the rock absorbs the water, its fundamental properties change. It becomes less dense, more pliable, and, critically, much weaker. This water-weakened layer within the tectonic plate creates a point of failure. Eventually, under immense pressure, this weakened section of the lithosphere begins to peel away and sink under its own weight into the deeper mantle, a process geologists call delamination. This peeling and sinking action is the very first stage of subduction. What scientists are observing in real time southwest of Iberia is this process in action, the blueprint for a future Atlantic ring of fire being drawn before their eyes. The immediate implications for humanity are stark. As this new zone of subduction evolves and accumulates stress, the risk of another mega-earthquake, potentially reaching a magnitude of 9 or even higher on the Richter scale, will increase dramatically. Such an event would be an international catastrophe. It would generate a transoceanic tsunami that would radiate outwards across the entire Atlantic basin. The densely populated coastlines of Western Europe, Portugal, Spain, France, the United Kingdom, and Ireland would be in the direct path. The Atlantic coast of Africa, particularly nations like Morocco, would face immense destruction. And across the ocean, the eastern seaboards of the United States and Canada, along with the islands of the Caribbean and the coast of South America, would have only a few hours to prepare for the arrival of powerful waves. This discovery forces a complete and urgent reevaluation of seismic and tsunami risk for the entire Atlantic region, an area where major cities and critical infrastructure have been built under a now false assumption of geological safety. This groundbreaking research, 
published in prestigious scientific journals, highlights how little we still know about the inner workings of our own planet. It underscores that the Earth is a living, breathing system, constantly changing and evolving in ways we are only just beginning to comprehend. The forces at play are almost incomprehensibly vast, operating on timescales that make a human lifetime seem like the blink of an eye. The quiet, dark depths of the Atlantic are not as dormant as we believed. They are an active geological laboratory, and the experiments being conducted there could have profound consequences for us all. The ground beneath our oceans is not static, and its secrets, now being revealed, remind us that our world is in a constant state of powerful, dynamic creation.